That blouse is horrible. Riddle bitch. Relax. I don't want to talk to you either. I'm here to see Laura. Why to offer your condolences? Yes. I take it you know what really happened to Nicholas? I do. And I have to wonder. Were you in on it with him? Fun accusing me of having something to do with Nicholas's death when all along you knew he was alive and well and had staged the whole thing. I have to congratulate you on your performance. You're crying for your dear beloved friend and all the while you were scheming with him. How dare you? I didn't know he was alive. I grieved for him. And now I'm still grieving for him. But I don't regret one syllable of what I said because the truth is, Nicholas would have never faked his death if it hadn't been for you. What? You were the one who sent him to Greece in the first place. He was trying to get away from you. He ended up in Greece because you were blackmailing him. He couldn't stand to live with you for one more second, so he was willing to fake his own death just to get away from you. That man tried to kill me. And he regretted it ever since. He saw something in you, Hayden. What that was, I will never know. But he genuinely wanted to spend the rest of his life trying to make it up to you. He married you, for God's sake. And you betrayed him. Not because I wanted to. I loved him. No, you tricked him into marrying you so you could get control over ELQ. Nicholas fell in love with you while you were scheming with Tracy the entire time. I didn't have a choice. Tracy knew I was Rachel Berlin. She threatened to tell the feds where I was. And then I found out that Nicholas, the man I was falling in love with, tried to have me killed all because I threatened to expose a secret. A secret he was keeping for you. Take that bitch. Suffering from selective memory loss because this chain of events doesn't start with me. It starts with you. If you hadn't been so desperate to hang on to Jason, Nicholas wouldn't have cared if I revealed Jake Doe's true identity. That's not the only reason Nicholas kept quiet. Okay, yes, he had some selfish motives, but mostly he kept the secret about Jason from you. And you were so hysterical that day. You were so upset that I was going to tell Jason the truth. What else was Nicholas going to do? Of course he had to shut me up for your sake. You put Nicholas on the road that led to his death. So instead of pointing fingers at me, why don't you take some of the blame yourself? I don't know why anything is anymore. You can't just brush this off against me. When you and Nicholas, since identity from him, you set off a chain reaction that affected everyone in this town. So that means you're not guilty? You never lied to Nicholas? Both you you never are guilty. used or manipulated him? I loved him. Well, then you really blew it, didn't you? Because he loved you too. Against all advice, against all warning, he opened his heart to you. Which meant you had the chance to make something real, to build a life together. But you, Hayden, you with all your lies and your greed, you threw it away with both hands. You choke on it. I hope it keeps you up at night, and I hope you never stop regretting what might have been. I would have kicked her ass. <laughs> 